Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. And if you're new, here we share good food from a Geordie kitchen. This is your weekly run through of everything we've been having for tea this week. Starting from last Monday, going all the way through till Sunday. Now as you know, I had a bit of a run in with the stairs last week and Mr Howie has been doing all the cooking in the kitchen and he's been doing very well, bless him. So the meals are heavily relying on a few convenience foods but he's, he's going to try this week and do a little bit better. So this was last Monday, this is just when I came home, the day I came home and he made me a, an egg mayonnaise and bacon bit sandwich. And that was his technique there. He, he uses a tidy masher to make his um, egg mayonnaise. And it works very, very well, I have to say. So, yeah, he's, he's been doing his best, bless him. But to be honest, I haven't really felt like eating much. So it's been all right just having the ready meals and the convenience foods. And the poor on some very, very strong painkillers. And they just... I just don't... I just don't really have much of an appetite and I'm still in a bit of pain so this is what we've been having this week. So he just uh, piled all that filling onto a, a white roll and a bit of salt and I just had a packet of crisps with that. He had, he had to put them on the plate. Eating with one hand is quite an adventure. <laughs> And I had a, a chocolate mousse as well. So it's been really, it's been a, a very big learning curve trying to eat and look after myself this week. But we're managing. So this is Tuesday. This is Jim Kitchen's um, ready meal. This is mac and cheese with pulled pork. And it was all right. I didn't really understand why they made it a mac and cheese and then filled it with... <laughs> with the, the barbecue flavours but you know it was all right it filled a gap so that was wednesday sorry tuesday <laughs> no on a wednesday mr howie actually popped out and went to marks and spencer for a bit of a treat for the meals so this is their their tin chicken soup and it was lovely it was just what i fancied and we had that with their um tiger bread the fresh tiger bread this is the best tiger bread i've ever had in my life absolutely delicious really really lovely so i thoroughly enjoyed that even eating it with one hand it was delicious <laughs> so that was wednesday and i also got one of these i've never had these i've often seen them these strawberry meringues i've often seen them in the store and he picked one of those up for us like, they make you very messy especially if you're, you're eating it with one hand trying to trying to eat it, all that meringue <laughs> you end up with shards of it down your front but it was lovely. Really, really nice treat. So on a Thursday, this is their Marks and Spencer macaroni cheese. I usually buy these for my son because he loves them. But I decided to have one as well. And there it is, just served simply in the bowl. Trying to eat everything with one hand and a spoon. It's just, oh, dreadful. <laughs> but we're getting there. So this is from Farm Foods. This is what we picked up the last time we were there. These are steam bags. So this was chicken Thai chicken curry, but it was more like a, a stir fry, really. I think um, it was all right. It had a lot of peppers in it, which I don't think a Thai curry would have in. But you know, I was hungry. I ate it. It was fine. I wouldn't repurchase though. <laughs> that was Friday. So this is Marks and Spencer's chicken and chips ready meal and it was beautiful it was exactly like your KFC it was lovely and that was done in the air fryer by the mister and it was lovely really enjoyed it so on a Sunday this is uh, Marks and Spencer roast pork count and us meal which I really enjoyed as well really really lovely those potatoes were heavenly and this is their cabbage medley that I had on the side just to have sort of like a, a Sunday dinner really, you know. And that was really, really nice. Enjoyed that very, very much. They're counting us meals. They don't taste like diet meals. They are delicious. Really, really nice. We will be getting them again. I'm trying to lose a few pounds just before we go away. I'm going away at the end of the month, so I have to fit into a dress. 
<laughs> as you know how it is so that was the week so I, I just want to talk about some shoes I've been sent these before I had me, me fall these were sent to me very very kindly by Fitville Fitville shoes and if you like me and you have very very wide feet these will be a godsend so they said I could choose any pair so I chose these ones because I like the pastel colours and if you have wide feet these come with a very very wide toe box and I, I wore a pair of um, Converse when I went to London once and when I got back from my trip I actually lost my toenails because they were that tight but I've never worn shoes like these these were fabulous so much room in them toe box and they were very very bouncy as well yes, they have a cushion sole they help your feet your ankles and knee pain as well and the fittings the width fittings go up to a 4e it was like walking on a cloud they were fabulous there's proper arch support as well and they're slip resistant and they also help correct your feet if you have a different a different gait or flat feet they were fabulous i thoroughly thoroughly recommend them they're going to be a godsend this week when i'm recovering and i'm starting to walk around again because i have quite a lot of pain in my spine now i will say that i did size up with these and there was absolutely no need so that you can imagine the room i've got in them so i'm a 40 european 40 and i sized up to a 41 and i don't think you need to do that i think if you get your normal size you'll be fine but it was quite freeing it even says on the box as well free your toes <laughs> so it was it was lovely just to have that wiggle room in the toes i mean you can see there how much room i have fabulous so they have kindly sent me those and they've sent me a special discount for everyone so i will link that discount and i will link the link the link to the website so you can purchase them and i'm going to leave you with a sneaky peek of the recipe of the month that we also managed to film before i had my fall so this is my carrot cake my family's carrot cake and that will be going up this week as well so you've got that look forward i'm so sorry about the crap meals this week but we are doing, do, going to do a little bit better this week mr howie is gonna gonna learn a few basic recipes so thank you for watching everybody take care and i'll see you all very very soon again take care now bye bye i went to blade and races it was on the 9th of june 1962 in a summer's afternoon we took the bus for Bamberg's and she was heavy laden And away we went to like Collingwood Street that's on the boat to Bladen And oh lad, you should have seen us gunning Passing the books upon the boat just